I'm somewhat of a completionist when it comes to Sea of Thieves. I like to buy everything, and I mean everything. And in order to fulfill my goals within the game, I need gold. There is only one problem though, time. I do not have the greatest amount of time on my hands, so I needed to find a way of hopping on the game and getting a bunch of gold and simply logging off, like most people. So that, my friends, is the point of today's video to find the most broken way of getting gold in Sea of Thieves. Subscribe. I've covered my fair share of methods to getting gold in this game. <laughs> That's no secret. And by far the most efficient is with a two-man sloop. So if you need someone to play with, join my Discord. There are just about a thousand other members of the community in there and ready to hop on Sea of Thieves and help you on your adventures. By the way, if you can time your adventures around Gold Rush, you can get an extra 1.5 times multiplier on all gold earned during this time. And it also stacks on the emissary system. And I'm also sure one of you maths geniuses in the comments can tell people how much the potential multiplier is with the grade 5 flag. I'll leave a link in the description to a webpage where you can track when Gold Rush is, so you can time your sail around that. Eventually, you're going to want to run the Reaper's flag, but not right away, as we will be leaving the boat unattended at points, and it's best that you don't leave yourself open to attacks when you aren't there to defend your boat. I have been doing a bunch of testing with the shrines and treasuries as of late, and it seems the refresh timer changes depending on the distance between you and the previous shrine you was at. So I like to run what I like to call the Golden Triangle. Two of the best shrines on the seas and a treasury all in one smooth rotation to earn yourself a lot, and I mean a lot of gold. You start at the Shrine of Tribute, drop one of your crew off to complete this shrine, storing the loot in the mermaids. Start heading over to the Shrine of Ocean's Fortune whilst your crewmate is down in the Tribute Shrine. Again, swim down and complete this shrine, and about halfway through your progression, this is when your teammate should finish the Shrine of Tribute, at which point they start sailing over to the Treasury of the Lost Ancients. Again, swim down and start completing the Treasury. I think you guys can start to picture where this is going. At this point, you will pick up the loot from the Shrine of Tribute before completing it again, and each of these shrines and the treasury contain a chest of tribute as well, so that's extra gold for you right there. I would suggest to run either the Gold Hoarder Emissary or Reapers, but that's entirely your choice. Reapers obviously gives you more money because you can sell more of the items with the Emissary bonus. Another thing you can do is shoot out to other islands in the surrounding areas to see if you can find coral bottles. These will have a chance of spawning Breath of the Sea at the shrines you're working on, giving you even more gold. If you have a longer period of time, you could do what myself and my friend Birch did. We stacked this loot cycle all day until Gold Rush. Not only was we doing this though, if World Events spawned on surrounding islands, we did those too. You could also cycle in the sea fort at Ancient Gold Fortress just to the southwest of the Shrine of Tribute to earn even more loot on your journey. Anyway, by doing this method, we was a Anyway, by doing this method, we was able to earn 2 million gold at Gold Rush, which is insane. This was in a 4-hour session, meaning we was earning around 500,000 gold per hour. Oh my god, that it bugged out so that like when I collected the treasure, the Momo was swimming down because the boat was too close to it, and now the loot is like right next to the boat. I'm gonna be a pain in the ass to get on. Do you want some? Go on, be generous out there. God, you sound like the Joker. <laughs> I'm the Joker, baby. I don't no, even have the energy. Scars. I reached uh, tier 100 and I had to pass. That's a pretty good one, right? Yeah, you, that's probably the funniest thing you've ever said. <laughs> I 
actually you have fun with this. Oh, nice. <laughs> Great teamwork. Mm. And when we do inevitably get into a fight, I need to remember to actually use like the anchor balls and like shit like that. Yep. Yeah. Also, uh, just a little request, like, you know, take it to heart if you want, but can you like not shoot off the boat? <laughs> I don't know, he's using a dash and wind scope. It's gonna be a poor place. Oh no. I just need a moment. <laughs> I just guys. need, please, I just please, need a moment to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. <laughs> <laughs> and ring the notification bell. <laughs> you are hitting him right on. There you go. Oh, I wouldn't give it a hit mark soon. The easiest world event, bro. So stupid how good how fast you can do this shit. A skull fort appears right next to us as well. Like what? That's what where I was gonna supply up. Fuck, dude. I guess I won't supply up this round. Yeah. You will not believe your eyes, bro. We have a fucking harpoon robot. Oh my god. N not a drill. Not a drill. We have a robot. Nice. We already started uh -oh. sailing. We got kraken. I fucking hate you so much. I. What? What? How is this my fault? <laughs> this is all your fault. I'm taking the robot away, right? No, just to leave it on. Can the kraken? I don't the... know. That's. The I'm thing. taking. I'm taking. I'm taking the robot away. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> Fucking um. Kraken, dude. I've got to cry. <laughs> okay, anchor if we're done. Oh, yeah, I'm heading back with the robots. I got repair. Yes, not. What? How what? we get so much rep for just opening the merm? I don't know. I think they're doing the fort. I've already claimed it. What do you want from me? I'm back. Help me grab them. I am. Oh my god, this black screen is gross. Oh, it's <laughs> gross. <laughs> oh my god, I'm still in it. <laughs> Dude, I'm starting to get more ping than FPS. Uh, like checking the map. They still haven't left. Oh, oh no! Oh no! No! Do we keep our merms? Do I we don't. Keep our merms? I don't know. I don't think so. We we'll see. We we'll see as we go past the treasury. No! It's because I dropped sail. That sucked, dude. Oh, oh my God. Our, our boat is floating. Oh, no. Hold on to something. Hold on to something. Oh, God. Goodbye. Oh. <laughs> it's a little bit far off our oh, road, okay. but I'll start heading to the last place. Okay. There's uh, 10 extra blunder bombs in one of the storage crates on the back. <laughs> Fuck, dude. We made money today. No fucking way. But I won't let the stormy seas throw me in open water. Let me have my peace and leave me to tomorrow. Wind into myself. Oh, we gotta just went out. I would have spent like 10 more. Oh my god, that is gross. What's oh, it, all my ping dropped down to back to normal. Immediately, dude. <laughs> oh my god. This server is back to normal now. Holy shit. <laughs>